Now at 11, a deputy is injured and a suspect in custody after pursuit in Kanawha County. Good evening. I'm Marilyn McAuliffe. Rob Macko has the night off. The deputy was not shot but injured when he crashed his squad car during the chase. Our 13 News reporter Aaron Noon is near Sissonville with the details. Aaron, what can you tell us happened? Merrily, Kanawha County deputies have detained two people and they have recovered a gun following this incident near Sissonville earlier tonight. Now, this all happened around 7 this evening when a deputy tried to pull over the driver of a pickup truck for a traffic violation. The driver took off and it shortly became a high speed chase. During the chase, one deputy crashed into another vehicle on Sissonville Road and caught fire. The deputy suffered minor injuries and the other driver was also taken to a hospital. Hospital. The chase continued along a gas line right of way near North Grapevine Road when a passenger in the truck began shooting at a pursuing cruiser, shattering the windshield. That deputy was not hit. The deputy lost sight of the vehicle and discontinued the pursuit. After an extensive search, two people were found and detained for questioning. Now, deputies say they do not believe that the, the public is in danger at this time, and there's no word yet on what charges, if any, the two detained will face. Reporting in Sissonville, Aaron Noon, 13 News, working for you.